What is going on ladies and gentlemen, Mark here bringing you another episode of Metro 2033. In the last episode if you remember we had to go into stealth mode and sneak our way through the library and into the depository and go to the safety deposit boxes and find the document relating to the missile launch center D6 which we have done. We avoided the majority of the librarians, the creatures that you'd saw and yes, now Driving to Sparta, I had found the D6 documents, but Miller had not yet returned. Without his help, I wasn't certain I could get out of the library alive, but everything depended on it. So without further ado, let's get into it. It's okay buddy, it's okay. Okay, that's what happens when you don't return your books ladies and gentlemen. That's what the librarians turn into. Haha, <laughs> funny old man. Very good. Yeah, of course I did. I'm a ranger now, come on. I did, yes. I don't understand that. He's my friend. Awesome. He's psychic. He has some amazing powers. So right now I've basically turned the game volume down. Uh, for copyright reasons there is music playing and I don't want to get a strike. So... I'll just sort of talk just now while we're going here and hopefully it's never done anyway. Well, luckily we have subtitles so it's not as if you guys are missing out in any of the dialogue. There's always a bright side ladies and gentlemen, there's always a bright side. Okay that should be the music stop now. I was put in charge of radio monitor. Our hope was to contact the government bunkers over the Urals, but those bunkers were the first to be hit. At first, they didn't direct Um, right. Oh, wow, that's a big gun. I'm assuming that goes in the back of a car like a... Hello. Hello there, Vladimir. Really? I get to choose any one of these things? It is awesome. What kill do you have? Okay, oh, I would like you... Uh, oh, yes, can I have that, please? Can I customise it as well? Oh, I don't have to pay for it either. That's awesome. Right, we'll go by reflex site because I, don't, I like that. Silence that takes the damage off of. I don't know what that. Okay. A uh, shotgun. Is there any, I don't know, but like better shotguns? I don't think there are. What is this? Heavy machine gun is deadly at close range but eats free ammo at a high pace and does not accept silencers. Yeah, I don't really think you'd. I, I don't really think you would need a silencer, let's be honest. The real gun shoots ball bearing balls or ball or bearing balls. We call it ball bearings over here in the United Kingdom. At incredible speed, but it takes time to charge. Its capacity deals low damage if fired before fully charged. That's crazy, actually. A shotgun made from bicycle parts. That's. <laughs> that's <laughs> okay, we'll just take what we've got then. Um, and that's the pneumatic rifle. Can I customise that? What what don't I have? I R C reflex site, yeah we'll go with that. Uh put both of that on it. Wait, oh wait, I've taken the site off, haven't I? Yep. Sell your belly. Uh, I think that's us. Unless I can customise more of this. No. Uh, we are good then. Thank you very much, Vladimir, I appreciate it. Hello old man. It's good to hear from you, my friend. It looks like you're kept busy with the chopping of the blocks. Hey, nice hat. 
Oh yeah, very good, very good. Got to keep that muscle going for when the Nasala sees not. Oh, can, huh? Hey, bro. Hello there, Artyom. Hello. I told you we'd meet again. You did. It's a nice base the Rangers got themselves. That's a bit over the top, I suppose, isn't it? Then again, religion affects everyone different. No help from Polis. None. Your next move. To take the fight. Silent. You're turning into a Ranger. Take a close look at the road you follow, Artyom, and be aware of how it might end. That you sounds very ominous. So, Artyom, force answers force. War breeds war, and death only brings death. To break this vicious circle, one must do more than just act without any thought or doubt. Okay. Well, Artyom, I've been chatting here for far too long. Yeah. It's time to go. Yeah, we better get ourselves ready. Okay, let's go and talk to Miller and see what he has to say for himself. Hello there, Miller. Okay, okay, okay. There's not much useful in here. Just hints at most. Although it does show the way to D6. Well, that's our destination then. Alright, okay. Are you ready? As I'll ever be. So, how are we faring? Well, man. Holy crap, you all got up here quick. Settle up then. Buckle. Oh yeah. Balcony. I think that means saddle up. Oh let's go. Oh, who cares? Let's just go, okay? Let's go and let's go and hunt us some monsters. I like how old man just whistling, you know. Like it's a good day out. Let's go possibly to our deaths, but we'll have a good time while we're doing it. I'll just overtake you because you're taking too long. You as well, old man. Um Hey guys, uh, he's making a spectacle of himself. What's down here? Is this the way we're supposed? I hope it is. If not, I'm. Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, it is. Okay. Dark tunnel, wheel rattle, and the smell of death. That's how our journey to D6 began. But our goal seemed closer now. Okay, chapter 6, D6. Let's get into it. Let us do this, comrade. There was an explosion in the tunnel, and lots of people were buried alive. A rumor has it they survived, but no longer resemble humans. Oh dear. I don't like that. Can, would believe it. Okay, um, what, what, um. I'm not dead, am I? Cause that's gonna suck. That's quite a bad way to go. Ooh, it's very bright. I can hear the birdies singing. What? Don't shout on me. Right, that was a silhouette of one of those things, I think. Okay. You guys aren't gonna kill me, are you? Because that's that'd be very unfortunate. What? Wait, wait. I'm dreaming. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, did I wake up? God damn it, Miller. I am. Yep. I'm good. Don't worry about me. I don't know. Something happened though. I like how everyone just goes back to Romo. Ultium, what was it? Bang, everyone's back to their positions again. I do not like this place, comrade. It smells like deer. 
Jeff is something I am accustomed to. Boris, what are you doing? Damn it. Oh yes. Now this is what I like. Ha <laughs> ha! Okie dokie man! Yes, no doubt. The Nosalysis! Let him come closer! Closer! Boom! Burn baby burn! This go inferno! Right, I think we're doing pretty well here. Anybody want some bacon this Alice's? Come on now. All you can eat. God damn it. God damn it. No. I can't watch your back. I can't even watch more. And oh, God, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Yep, that. Yeah, that wasn't really fair. The fact that all my weapons weren't reloaded. So basically, that. Oh man. Okay, let's start that again. I'm not ignoring shit. Hey, you let me replace the weapon. God damn it. Right, okay, we're gonna have to make do here. Right, I'll just let them come closer to me and then I'll just spray them because I think I was wasting a lot of napalm there. Just gushing into nothing. Hey. Seem to be doing okay here. You guys alright? Well done guys. I'm nearly running out of napalm here, it's going into the red section. Okay. Don't touch it. Don't, don't, don't. Leave it. Leave it. Go, 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 go. Go. Oh, really? Not cool, guys. Not cool. Oh, it's speeding up. It's getting angry because we're moving. Oh, dear. Can remember told me don't move and it won't touch you. Okay, well, we're okay. Ooh. We did make it, yes. Certainly not, my friends. Certainly not. We done well there. Held our ground like true Spartans. There we go, finally. Right. Now I can get my shotgun back and cause some damage, hopefully. Okay, okay. Okay, I've got flies everywhere. I got flies all over me, god. Oh, we got a... My strange dreams still continue. I am no longer sure if they are just dreams anymore, and it never happened to me before. The dreams are more like visions, and they become more and more vivid, still holding sway over my conscience even after I wake up. Even I can't. Uh, even I still can't understand their meaning. Yet, time after time, I wake up with the same heavy feeling, 
the premonition of a catastrophe, one brought about by my own actions. Lord, you know, so you're going to be the, you're going to be like one of the the horsemen. You're going to bring the apocalypse home. Oh wait, can I put my light on too? Because I want to be a part of the Rangers. Yeah. Okay, I'll let my job since you guys obviously don't want to do anything. The chaos of the tunnel was locked away behind the airlock gates. They seemed invulnerable. And at that moment, so did my comrades. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to end the episode there. If you did like it, a like would be appreciated. If you are new around here, hit the subscribe button. It's free and it could be your good deed for today. And yes, again, thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next episode. See you later.